Welcome back, Orin Beers. I don't know why Ben has me saying this all the time. It's in my contract now. We're gonna show you the, some more of the collection. We're actually gonna fill out the last 20 of our adult breeder females on this video. And then it's on the males. So stay tuned. All right, so leading off the, the charge here, we have this Enchi Banana 100% Het Clown, right? Yeah. Enchi Banana Het Clown, yep. Look how big she is. Who hopefully is gonna give us some nice little babies this year. And uh, we're gonna be careful with these because we did just feed them. Just like in the last video, we're actually doing two videos on the same day. We just fed all these like yesterday and today. This girl is one of our original lavender albino females. And last week she got a little bit of a nipple on her nose, but it's healing up nicely. But this is just a 100%. Yeah, 100%. It is a She's lavender albino. 100% visual. 100% visual lavender albino. <laughs> Super cool. I love that girl. So this is uh, in shed, but this is a Enchi Butter, who we have right now. We're actually debating about selling this one. I don't know. It's a shame that all these guys are in shed, but you can see the pink belly and the cloudy eyes. Enchi and everything. Hashtag Enchi and everything. <laughs> This is a 100% het lavender albino female. Mm-hmm. Which, now we have two of them. <laughs> but yeah. she's proven, um, I mean a proven breeder. The other one is 100% het because we produced her, but... We produced both of these. Yeah, we produced both of them, but uh, the other one hasn't bred yet. And again, in shed. Is she? Dang. This is our... Pastel Lori, female. Hmm. What a beautiful snake. So nice. Very cool. Has like a green hue to it. Yeah. We love our Lori stuff. Mm-hmm. Man, she's amazing. That's right. Breeder female Lori stuff. Come at me. And another one that's in shed. She's always dark looking, but she's in shit. So this is a GHI female that also came from an Arroyo clutch. So, um, I don't know. We produced Arroyos, but we put her again to an Arroyo GHI. So like, yeah. it's impossible. Uh, we didn't hit any Rios though. So Not that I think. We did hit a super GHI of that clutch. We did. But, uh. We'll have to put her to something not Arroyo this year and see if any Arroyos come out. This girl's going to lay eggs in like a week. This is an Enchi Spider female. You can see how her belly has popped out here. She yeah. ovulated a couple weeks ago. And More than a couple. Uh, a few. Mm -hmm. A few six weeks ago. She'll be our first clutch of 2021. Would we pair her to? Uh, GHI Arroyo Fire. Trying to make more Arroyo stuff for you guys. GHI Arroyo Fire, that's cool. Excited. Here we have a big fire female. Fire! Has like the burnout ringer here. Again, in shed. Fire burnout! Is that time of year, guys? Like, your breeder females are pounding food right now. Because they're trying to build follicles for you. Mm -hmm. So everything's going to be in shed. Follicles! <laughs> I'm going to do that for the rest of the video. Comment down below if you don't like me doing that. This is a huge Hep Pod female. Mm-hmm. 
She's eighty five hundred grams. No, I'm just. <laughs> She's ten thousand grams. One hundred percent hip hide female. We produced and we proved her out because she produced for us. So. Yes. This girl is chonky. Hey, are you doing this video or am I doing this? Good. Video? Sorry. Shut up. <laughs> So this is an Arroyo female that is possible Rio that we got from Dan Wolf. She is very tense. She is a Rio. She looks like it, but... She's produced all Arroyos that we... I keep saying that. Well... Do we look in the paperwork? We did, but the, it's hard because we called some of them not Arroyo because we weren't sure back in the day. Pass. Because we started, pretty much started our entire Arroyo project with GHI. And they like kind of mesh together so well that it's difficult to tell. They do a lot of the same things. Yeah. And we always we were just saying that. <laughs> yeah. We were just saying that Rio Super GHIs would be cool. Mm -hmm. What I was thinking. <laughs> Which we're getting close to because we have a Super GHI Rio now. This little lady is a Super Lori female. Super Lori, beautiful, beautiful animal. And people say, why? What's the difference between this and Het Red Exantic? Or Red Exantic, I guess. Look at that. So busy. Again, a bit in shed, so she's not as silver as she usually is, but. But she is silver, still. Gorgeous animal. Hopefully we're making uh, some Lori clown stuff with her this year. Mm-hmm. Here we have a orange stream spider. Beautiful. It's the last spider in the collection. Orange Dream works so nice in Spider. Yep. Do they call them honeybees? What is it? What's a honeybee? Uh, it's Orange Goose. Oh. Uh, uh, spider? I know that Anchi Spider is a Stinger Bee. I don't stinger know. Stinger Bee, that's what they call it. This is OD, so I don't know if there's one for OD. Here we have the mm. Pastel Orange Dream. Mm hmm. Gorgeous. This is the only snake we've sold and bought back. <laughs> did do that and it was kind thankfully of, kind of funny yeah we sold it and we were like you know that was stupid and like a little while later decided to buy it back from our boy Matthew Cleaver that's right there's not a video that's going by in like the past two months that hasn't had his name <laughs> in it. that's crazy he text me a lot and I just think about him all the time I guess I don't know here we have and Enchi Mojave. Big girl. Mm hmm This is we bought one Enchi female and then I bought like four Enchi girls that were code mixed jeans and mm -hmm. she's one of the originals, so we've had her for a long time. Oh, I love it. Enchi Mojave. And this was a, another one. That oh. same group. Oh, 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 oh. This is a cinnamon enchi, 100% het clown. You like that? Now we all know that we know now that this is an Alila combo, mm -hmm. which is kind of surprising that I didn't find that out until like last year. <laughs> I'm sure some of you guys were in the know before us, but it surprised a lot of people. She painted the walls. Yeah. This is a pastel Mojave leopard. Mm hmm. Pastel Mojave leopard. Leopard works so well with Mojave. All the Belgian stuff. Really good combo. Mm hmm. Here. 
We have a pastel leopard, 100% head clown. See how the Mojave like reduces the leopard out of it a good bit. Like the difference between the two is so stark. A lot of people don't like pastel these days, but I I like pastel. Yeah, no, pastel works great in a lot of combos. Sometimes not in all combos, but a lot of combos. Here we have an Enchi Highway. Who's in shed? And what's highway? A highway is a gravel yellow belly. Yeah, yeah, you can say it fine. Enchi gravel yellow belly. On the highway. <clears throat> you done? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Got a lot of outbursts from you today. <laughs> Very tough. Man. Here. There you go. You got to see this. This is a Firefly Orange Dream. It comes from our fire line that has a lot of that melty stuff going on. We produced her. And like ringers and stuff. Mm -hmm. That's so cool. She's beautiful. And huge. And last but not least. Last snake. For some reason, this bin gets super wet. But she's in shed too. Dang it. So this is a Superfly Calico. Super Pastel Fire Calico. It doesn't look like a Super Pastel Fire Calico. Something else is going on for sure. It always throws really w weird stuff. And when she was born, she was all white. Just about. Hatched out completely white. Thought it was a, a black eye leucistic, even though the pairing was not, that was not possible. Mm -hmm. And then shed by shed, all this little stuff started coming in. And you can see the eraser type dorsal, which is the mother. Mm -hmm. In past videos, you've seen the uh, super fly calico hinge moma stuff that has this eraser stuff. This could be the girl that had the cryptic in her. But I don't know. Yeah. I keep on tossing around this whole cryptic idea. Ryan is not a fan of me saying it, but... It's just a bold claim to not be able to back up. Just as some crazy stuff that we made. Some crazy babies, you know? Yeah. There's definitely something going on for sure. Mm -hmm. So there you have it. <laughs> Alright guys, I really hope you enjoyed the update. We're in the home stretch here. If you like what we're doing, let us know down in the comments. If you have any other ideas of stuff you want to see, leave that in the comments too. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, notification bell, all that jazz. Her House Rock, we got Frank Payne on tonight. Lizard King, check that out. <laughs> see you later, guys. As long as you don't mess up, no pressure. I'm trying not to mess up. When I'm dancing in the camera, it shakes, and then I realize that when I'm watching the editing stuff, shaking doesn't really equate to people that I'm dancing, it just equates to that I, the camera shaking, which is stupid. That is stupid. People know, I'm dancing. <laughs> okay. <laughs>